fertilizer prices have risen to nearly double what they were last year. So this year it pays really well to time our applications of anhydrous ammonia and manure correctly. In addition to all the soil health building qualities of manure, let's also consider what the fertilizer value is. So let's say a uh, typical swine finishing manure, uh, maybe around 50 pounds N, 15 pounds P2O5, and 30 pounds K2O. That fertilizer value in recent years has been between $25 to $35 per 1,000 gallons. But this year that number is much closer to $65 per 1,000 gallons. So at an application rate of 4,500 gallons per acre, that sums up to over $290 per acre of fertilizer value. So manure is highly valuable this year in addition to anhydrous ammonia, which some people have seen rise over $850 per ton this year. So it's October 12th, we've got the beans out. Should we be out here applying our manure or anhydrous ammonia right now? The answer is no, and the reason is because the soil temperatures are still far too warm to be applying that form of ammonia nitrogen. We really wanna wait until the soils are 50 degrees and cooling to apply those. And that usually happens around early November or so. You can keep an eye on your soil temperatures by visiting the ISU Soil Moisture Network. It's a great website where you can go on and keep an eye on the soil temperatures at four inches uh, by county. So you can look at your region to see when the soils have cooled. So the warmer weather we've had has really kept soil temperatures high, even with some cool down happening. So just two days ago, October 10th, the Soil Moisture Network has shown us that at four inches, the soil temperature was between 60 degrees in northwest Iowa to over 75 degrees in parts of southeast Iowa. So application of manure or anhydrous ammonia in these high soil temperatures is extremely risky. And that nitrogen will be susceptible to major losses, even using a nitrification inhibitor. At those high of temperatures, we're still at some point going to get some conversion of that ammonia to nitrate, and that nitrate will be susceptible to loss when we do have excess moisture sometime in the future. Recent ISU research has found a four-year average yield reduction for corn of 38 bushels per acre when we applied manure after soybean harvest, but early in the fall before the soils have cooled. And this is compared to waiting until the soils were 50 degrees and cooler. So at $5 corn, that's $190 per acre of value, just by waiting a few weeks for the soils to cool. So find more information on this topic by following the links to more resources and have a happy and safe harvest. Mm -hmm.